When it comes to Tony Busby, I'm uh, I'm I'm just real. What you see is what you get. I don't pretend to be somebody I'm not. And uh, sometimes you just don't and, know uh, what you're gonna get. Uh, but on this day, Auntie. yes. Welcome to my house. Thank you. Hanging out with the aggressive trial attorney and mayoral candidate struck a new chord. You have your basic G. This man rocks. No, literally, he does. Trying to get up that great big hill. Call us the Busby Band. Me and Tony in tune, or at least trying to be. He goes, hey, hey, hey. He plays the piano and the guitar. Music is how he unwinds from the stresses of tough cases and now a vigorous mayoral campaign. Uh, usually if I'm not uh, working at my office, I'll be working right here. He's quite the Renaissance man. He has books of poetry he's written over the years. He took a deep breath, perhaps the deepest of his life, and he jumped, but he didn't fall. He soared. And when he's not spitting out rhythms and rhymes, he's playing with his dogs. This is one of how many dogs? I have three. Poor old Lacey. Lucy, Lacey, and Lily. And while the millionaire attorney sleeps in one of the most expensive houses in Houston, right on River Oaks Boulevard, he says his beginnings were humble. His mom, a school bus driver, dad, a meat packer. Busby went on to graduate from Texas A&M. I was a battalion commander. Of and then he became a Marine. This is called spy rigging. It's when they, it's a special extraction of uh, how they pull troops out of jungle environments and stuff. And that's me there, there at the bottom. A Marine, a father, an attorney, a musician. The list goes on. On. There are many faces of Tony Busby, but now he's trying to hit a higher note with voters. He's hoping to wear another face, Houston's next mayor. What's going on? Okay, okay I got you. Here we go. Cut, cut. We're done. <laughs>